It's time. Look at this. All this gorgeous farmland. Yes. We are ready. We are excited. We're about to kill it with kindness. We don't really need our sword, but you know what? We're not going to get all about that right now. We're not going to have feelings about that. Because you know what? Feelings don't get seeds planted. Feelings don't get farms taken care of. And deceased grandfathers made proud. That was surprisingly painless. All right, let's get hoeing. Here's how we're going to hoe this. This year, it's nothing but hoes. I think I'm going to chill out a little bit with this top row. You know what? Yeah, because you know what? It, it's not going to be symmetrical, which I don't like anyway. Okay. Well, let's get going. Let's get hoeing. I think that's as far as I can take it, right? I can't hoe. Get out of here, cursor! It floated in with the clouds. You know what we need to do? Just to make sure that crows behave themselves. We need to divide this up a little bit here. Let's, uh... Leave a path in the middle. Not that big of a path. I guess I'm not going to be able to have things symmetrical. Nobody lets me have anything nice. But, okay. We still need a place to put scarecrows. <laughs> My energy is, like, almost gone. What's going to happen when it's time to water this shit? I am going to be in trouble... These videos are going to get short, because <laughs> I'll be like, well, that's all I've done for the day <laughs> It's water. See, I'm making a mistake, and I should stop myself. I know this is a mistake, but I'm just trying to embrace the spirit and the nature of the game as it truly is. A relentless grind. It's like I'm starting to feel exhausted, but that's because I'm hoeing. Hoeing is tiring. Yeah, eat the field snack. Eat another one. Yeah. Yeah. That's good for now. And then we'll, we'll have something a little bit more substantial on our way to town. You know? To buy our seeds. We won't be buying any food because I'm going to waste all of our money. Not waste. Invest all of our money on seeds. Invest like a rich person would. Put this here... We gotta put some of this stuff away, though. Because we gotta go buy seeds. I know we'll need some of it later. Lord knows we'll need some of it later. There's no time for fishing or fighting today. Hello, Pierre! I'm here for you to rob me! Boop. Here goes all my money. I'm gonna have to fish. As long as we're here. I didn't sell that bitch any of my... Ah. You know what? I need to eat all that stuff. I can't sell it to him. Yeah, all that stuff that I ended up forgetting to sell. It's like, maybe it's a good idea because I've got no energy and I just found all my money on seeds. Let's go drop some stuff off to my friends, the ghosts. You didn't hear me burp, but if you did, we're all friends here. Bingo! Bet I'll have room. There he goes! Oh, something new is gonna happen! Yes! The bulletin board. Now we're cooking with gas. Just gonna sneak right past you. Harvey always looks like he's squatting. We gotta go back and check this out. Oh, he stopped. 
See, doesn't it look like he's squatting? He walks a little bow-legged. While I'm doing this, I'm finishing my hoeing, I'm gonna tell you a story. Um, I know that if you if you go to my blog or if you're on the Discord or something like that, you somewhere in passing you may have found out that I direct children's theater. Um, for a community theater. Occasionally. And that involves some rough disciplinary conversations sometimes with kids. Because it'll be like, you know, you have to you have to make sure that they're toeing the line, you know? And there's one kid that I absolutely love, but he's one of those kids that he will do anything for a laugh. Like he will just keep going and keep going and keep going, right? So one day <laughs> we had to have a talk with him and had to have his mom come in because it was like he'd already had a few warnings, right? So anyway, we had to have this meeting with this kid's mom and him. And I had to say what it was that we were meeting about, which is hard to do. For one thing, I feel bad. I have to say, the girl that he said this to is very sweet. Very sweet. And it really hurt her feelings. And that is not funny. And that is not okay. But objectively, the thing that this kid said to her was hilarious. So I had to say it with a straight face, right? I had to like not laugh in front of this kid and make him think that I approve. And I go to try to say what he said. And my musical director said it instead. But here's the thing. She got it wrong. What she said was, he told this girl that she was as ugly as Shrek. And the kid's mom is like, well, that doesn't sound like him at all. Right? Like, and I was like, okay, well, actually, that isn't what he said. What he said was, you're like an uglier version of Shrek. And the mom goes, yeah, that sounds more like him. Anyway. <laughs> I love that kid dearly. I, it's not, I, all, all kids have a little pepper in them. And when sometimes that pepper shakes out, it's not nice. They're not being good citizens to other people. The hardest part about like working with kids in any capacity really is telling them that something is wrong and knowing that it's wrong in your heart, but still having an appreciation for the inherent naughtiness of what they did. I am losing daylight. This is going to be rough to have to water all of this. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to, um, yeah, I hear you, little bird warning me that I'm failing. I hear you. I hear you every day in my head. The little bird that tells me I'm not good enough. Alright, executive decision. We're gonna plant this much tonight. I can't see shit because of this stupid cursor is fucking me up, making my life a living hell. People don't respect me or understand me. My inventory is full. My shit's all fucked up. <laughs> Nobody likes me. I smell bad. Cause oh my gosh, now I'm messing with torches. Shit is getting desperate down in here. Okay, I planted you in the wrong spot. It's all going to be okay, because now we're going to go uh, plant these five right across the top. You know what? Fine. I'll use the fucking thing, just like it wants me to. It makes it 10,000 times less fast. Less fast. Jenny, listen to yourself. I want to get these melons in. Folks, it's 120. We're not going to make it. We're not going to get the melons in. I just, I have to accept that my melons are going to be a day behind. I can't risk it. I can't risk any uneven rows. Let's do this. Yep. 